All right, let's get this shit over with here. <laughs> this is the greatest disappointment Kanye's ever given me. <laughs> the Pitbulls, what is it? Libert, no. Libertad. Oh, Libertad. 548. 548. Like, I had no expectations for Kanye and he still disappoints me. <laughs> I had no... Oh. No, I, I don't... I legitimately sympathise with you for having to listen to a Pitbull album. Alright, let's get you, this over with. You did send me one song to listen to. <laughs> I got through like 20 seconds. Get off. ready. I, I'm going to not lie. I listened to this album twice. Which is... More than, <laughs> more than what more should than be legally man, allowed. More than any man... Should ever have to endure. Should be able to take. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Actually, I'm not going to even lie. He started off the album actually quite good. On the okay. song Winning, I was like, okay, Pitbull quite hard. Please tell me it features Charlie Sheen. Or at least has a Charlie Sheen line <laughs> no, in it. No, no, no. <laughs> oh, I didn't listen out for that. No, it features Yomul Y.L. Danny. <laughs> Y.L. Danny? I, I don't know. I might be saying that wrong. I like how it's just like old Spanish and then it's just Danny. No, D-A-N-Y. So maybe I'm even saying that right. Like, oh, it's yeah. not D A W N Y. Danny? Danny. Danny. Oh. I'm going to actually play it because Pitbull actually comes in quite good. <laughs> like, I'm not even going to lie. I, I actually I had high hopes after this song came on. <laughs> I wish I could have seen your reaction after first hearing that. I was actually like, like okay. Unexpected. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to play a little bit of it. Okay. He obviously has his uh, Mr. 305, Mr. Worldwide. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Oh, that is good buzz. Yeah, Pitbull actually goes hard in the, in the yeah. first song. Um, but it doesn't go for much longer. It doesn't. Uh, it doesn't hold on. There's a song called Three to Tango," which, like the saying is, obviously it, it takes two to tango. Yeah. This man says in the first, like in the intro. <laughs> He says, now mathematically, this doesn't make sense, but in this scenario, one plus one equals three. <laughs> what? I don't even know. Oh, he's, he's cooked. He's talking about some sort of, some like sort of threesome, threesome action. Yeah. And, uh, um, I like, <laughs> I like how he, he clarified <laughs> that it doesn't make sense and mathematically. I like in the chorus, he says, tap that like a bongo. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> And he does try and make that rhyme with tango. It sort of does. Not quite. Um, and then at the start of the first verse, he says, Ladies and ladies, I am your gentleman. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually hard. <laughs> oh my God. I don't use that. <laughs> what have I had to endure? I actually, the song that comes straight after that, M- Moviandolo, I'm pretty sure I'm saying that wrong. Because um, he does say it in there. And it was it has been a while since I listened to it, but it is actually good. Like I can see where sort of Pitbull gets his um, fame from. He's actually quite good at picking melodies. He's like the the Spanish or not the Spanish. He's not Spanish. The Hispanic um, Post Malone. Like he's got a very good ear mm. for melodies. He's just sort of maybe this is good in in like the Hispanic scene, but it's not good um, for for me. <laughs> English people. Yeah. yeah, but I actually did like this song. The song is actually decent. Obviously, he has that. It's cl- it's I like that checking in. How much Spanish does he say? Like, is it more Spanish than English? Oh. Uh, well, there you go. There's Rams. <laughs> I like that Ooh, thing that he has. It's just sort of nice. It's just like a little bit. Yeah. Like, it's pretty nice. Like, you know what Hermanos means? What does that mean? Brother. Herma- her- what is it? Hermanos. Hermanos. Yeah. Or friend. There you go. One of them. Yeah, but the one song that's just fucking the worst is Get Ready, which is the one I told you to listen to. Jesus Christ, Pitbull and Blake Shelton. What the fuck were you thinking? <laughs> I didn't like rock music all that much, but Black Betty, you just don't touch it. <laughs> What is Black Betty? That's the one. 
Bam on that. Oh, Black Betty. Bam on that. Oh, that's yeah, what yeah. they interpolate. What was Pitbull, Pitbull interpolated that song? Yeah, this is... No. <laughs> could cross it could quite possibly be the worst song I've ever heard. As soon as it came on, I was just I was in awe. <laughs> I was in the car and I literally did this. This is my reaction. <laughs> I was just so Oh, I, there was literally no coming back from that. Like once that came on, I had a negative outlook on the album. <laughs> and I never no will change that. Happens. Yeah. And then Lil John, the song Cinco de Mayo, like, couldn't he get anyone other than Little John? <laughs> like, I haven't heard of him, like, probably since, like, Get Low with DJ Snake. Like, and he got ludicrous. Like, two people <laughs> that are like, like 2008. 10 years too late. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they're big in the smoke scene. This is Cinco de Mayo. That is... That's not English, is it? Okay. Is that the Pierre Bourne, like... Eh? I don't even know. The production's not bad. It's just not good. Pitbull, what type of music are you making? Like, who are you <laughs> making <of> music <laughs> for? It's just not good. Then we have a run of Spanish songs. I'll try and pronounce them just because it'll be funny and it can fill my review out. Mueve la cintura Me cuande contigo Se la vi I know that one Yeah And No No se le vanara There you go I'm Spanish now <laughs> And they feature El Mica I am Chino Papoyo Neo Lenier El Mica again Wait Neo Yep <laughs> As in, like, from 2008. Yeah. He's, he's a year... He's, he's a decade late on these ones. And then... Tito El Balbino. That's a cool name. That is a very cool name. And Guru Randhawa. Yeah, don't listen to this album. Sorry, Pitbull. If you send your lackeys for me, I'll... Um, I'll take them on. I'll show them actual good music. Um, yeah, Kanye West. My disappointment is immeasurable. That, like... That's the worst thing. Like, Kanye's done some stupid things over the year, but making me listen to Pitbull is the, is quite easily the worst. It's not a good album. I will never listen to any of those songs again. I will probably never listen to Pitbull again. And, yeah. I probably will never listen to Kanye again just because of this. <laughs> there is one good song on there. And it's the first song. <laughs> it is literally falls off a cliff after that. Like it doesn't slowly decline. It starts here. Well, you can't see that. It starts here and then just down here. And then it somehow gets lower. And then it goes up. Oh my god. I I can't listen to Pitbull say Mr. Worldwide one more time. Mr. 305. I literally I literally can't. I, I tried looking at um like how much he's earned this year right. just to see how well he's doing probably a lot 46 million this yeah. year but I wouldn't trust that because the article also says that Pitbull has taken the number one spot on Peep With Money's top 10 highest paid rappers for 2019 then just under red or just underneath in red they've got update this story seems to be false oh, there you go <laughs> they know their own stuff all right, well, that's me done. I'm giving it a 1 out of 10. <laughs> Generous. It's What's bad. How many tracks are there? Oh, 11, 12, something like that. It's dreadful. Okay. Well, I think that, uh, yeah, one's all it's right. It's more then. than I can take, I can tell you that. If you want a real review, I'm sure someone, some poor bastard online has done a more in-depth than that, but I, I don't think you can get much more than that. Maybe you have to do, do like a Spanish-speaking... Um, well, reviewer when I did the reviewer reviewer I was going to review someone reviewing that like the Libertad right um, and the only one I could find 
is I'm going to cut this out. Right. You said it's like 17 minutes long. I can't watch that. Well, there's only one review out there. Apparently, Robert's just shown me. No, there, there are more reviews. Oh, there's but more reviews. Like at that t- at the time I looked, oh, that was okay. it. Yeah, so maybe if you want to do that, maybe someone that's a bit more ingrained in the culture. I was sort of forced into this. This mate, this by Kanye. There are two reviews. Right. There's that one with 150 views. Right. And then this fella here from four hours ago, and we are the first view. Look at that. Oh yeah, he's Spanish, so maybe look at that one. Maybe he can give you a little bit more insight. I oh, know. Oh. Maybe. Yeah, he's. He can say. He can, he can say. <laughs> he can say Spanish. He can speak both languages, so maybe he's a little bit uh, of a more so with the. Yeah. So yeah. hopefully, Kanye release your album. Otherwise, what should I do next week? What's my punishment next week? Oh, no, don't keep doing that to yourself. He's not going to release it. Yeah, you're right. 